Howdy y'all. Uh, today we got some new keto products. I'll tell you what, me and my wife have been killing it on the keto and we have been trying a lot of things recently. You haven't seen the videos, but we got a lot coming up. We are going to try some keto cookies. I have not tried them. My wife whispered some stuff in my ear about how she liked them. Uh, but uh, I will go ahead and show you what we have. They're called fat snacks. They are fatty, fatty, fatty cookies. Uh, so we have three different kinds. They actually carry four different kinds, uh, but they kind of messed up on our order a little bit. So uh, today we got lemony lemon, we've got chocolate chip, and we have peanut butter. Now, in the pack that we ordered, we were actually supposed to be getting some double chocolate chip, and I'm probably thinking that my wife's gonna love that one, so hopefully we'll get some of that soon, but let's go ahead and dive into it. Okay, so this is the inside of the giant box that you get, and uh, it actually has a nice little saying inside. It says, I got 99 problems and a cookie is one, because when you're on keto, you know you can't have a lot of sweets, and you're craving those carbs, so uh, hopefully this is a good option. So first we're going to try, we're gonna try the lemony lemon last because that's the one my wife says she loves. Uh, so first we're gonna try the chocolate chip. Now what I love is on the front it tells you that it's keto friendly and it also tells you how many net carbs it has. This one here, the chocolate chip has two net carbs and then the peanut butter and the lemony lemon both have one net carbs. So, Mm. So they do smell pretty good. Uh, let's go ahead and look at the macros real quick. Uh, it has eight grams of total fat, two grams of protein. It has zero sugar. It has seven carbohydrates, two dietary fiber, and it has three sugar alcohol. So it works out to be your net carb. Now, this is actually for a keto product. This is a pretty good mixture of ingredients. Uh, they have some pretty raw ingredients. So it's got almond flour. It's got butter, chocolate chips. It's got stevia extract, sunflower lecithin. It has eggs, coconut flour. Uh, it has palm fruit oil and uh, it has xanthan gum and a few other things, salt. Okay, so let's get in there and see. Now it is kind of soft and I'll tell you what, I love soft cookies. Okay, so with this one here, it actually tastes a lot like the keto cookies that we made. Uh, being the number one ingredient is almond flour. It does have a little bit of that grainy texture in it. Uh, it does have a little bit of the almost like instant dissolve in your mouth when you're chewing it. And uh, as my wife was saying, when you eat it, it almost feels and tastes like the chocolate chips are added in there after they bake it. But you can see that they were baked inside. And I think that's really... Uh, a big uh, part of it being almond flour where it doesn't really cohese together or be very cohesive. Um, it's okay. I would probably give this one here maybe a three out of four stars. Um, it has a good flavor, but the graininess really gets to you a little bit. It's almost like chewing on sweet sawdust maybe. So uh, now we've got the peanut butter. It has all the same ingredients, except that this one has peanut butter inside. And it uh, peanut butter is the number one ingredient in this one, and almond flour is like the number seven ingredient. So I'm thinking this one might have a better texture and consistency. It's also soft. All right, so this one here actually has a little bit of a stevia aftertaste. Uh, it is still grainy but uh, it has a nice salty flavor. So the sweetness and the salty, I would also give this one maybe about a three and a half, three and a half stars. Um, it's okay, but with the stevia or the Epitol aftertaste in there, not really loving it. All right, so I'm excited to get into this one because this is the one that my wife was raving about. She called me and said, lemony lemon, it's pretty good. Okay, so it's got a really good lemon smell to it. Mm. 
Now that one is probably the best out of all the ones that I've tried so far. It does have a nice lemon zest flavor and a lemony flavor as well in the backdrop. It's still grainy, but the sweetness is good. The texture is good, and it's a little bit like a cakey uh, taste to it. And I would have to say this one, I would give a four out of five stars. I would give this one a thumbs up. Uh, personally, I would not order them again, but my wife says she really likes this one because of the cakiness, and it kind of reminds her of uh, one of those famous lemon cookies out there. I'm not going to say which one. Uh, but overall, if I were to get any more of these again, I would try the lemony lemon. Uh, but all in all, they're pretty good. If you love carbs, you love cookies, it might be a good option. For me, this is the only one I would go with. These cookies do have two-day shipping. They only charge $2.99 for two-day shipping. The funny thing is they actually ship through Amazon, uh, even though you buy them on their website. And uh, they come out of Las Vegas. So if, they're, if you're in Las Vegas, you might be able to pick them up. But uh, thanks for watching. If you like the information, please give us a thumbs up and check us out. We'll have down below our keto playlist that'll have a bunch of other reviews and keto tips for a low carb lifestyle. We'll talk to you later.